All right, so today I'm going to show you how to make uh, your Airport Express turn into a Wi-Fi range extender. So you're going to want to download the Airport Utility from the App Store. Um, you can also get a version of this for Windows, but for our purposes, um, I downloaded a version on my iPhone. You can do the same on an iPad or iPhone, I'm assuming. And I don't think this will show up in here right away. Um, I'm just going to test it real quick to see if it does. Bear with me here. Okay, so it doesn't show up in here. So what you're going to want to do is go to settings, go to uh, Wi Fi, and then it should show up as set up a new airport base station under your network list. So you want to click that. Now it says it's uh, preparing your Airport Express. And this, this, you do have like the Airport Express. In the meantime, it's like plugged in and it's been ready to go for like five minutes. And uh, make sure it's set to like default settings. And you, there's a quick online tutorial of how you can do it. All you got to do is uh, unplug it, press and hold in the uh, reset button on the back with the pen and then plug it back in while you're doing this and uh, and then hold it for seven seconds while it's plugged in seven long seconds and then that should re restore it to uh, default settings so anyway what we're gonna do next is uh, look at this here settings and kinda try and um, decipher this. I'm just going to look at the other options. Okay, I guess there's none. You can create a new network. Okay, other options. That's what we want. Next, rather than create a new network, which would be like an extra network, say Chelsea's network 1 is your current network, and Chelsea's network 2 would be your next network, you don't want two separate networks. What you're trying to do is expand upon Chelsea's network one and make it larger. So you want to do uh, add to an existing network, I believe. Yeah, so as you see the setting changed, so add to an existing network, set up this airport, express to join or extend an existing Wi-Fi network. Then you hit next, and then... Um, on, on the Mac, on my Mac, you could type in the address of the thing and then figure it out from there. But on this phone, it seems to give me like all of the uh, options of the Wi-Fi networks that are in range of mine. So you want to select, or if it gives you the option, type in the exact name down to the capital letters, spaces, and numbers. In my case, it's not this one. So you want to select that click next and then uh, you want to type in uh, your password um, I think that's to your network let me try that real quick and I think this would be also case sensitive as well if that applies so let's let's hit next and see if that works. Yeah, I'm not gonna save. So if this works correctly, what you can do is like say where the uh, Wi-Fi signal was weak at is set up this airport device in that room all you have to do is plug it into the wall and what it'll like just for electric I mean and what it'll do is it'll pick up Wi-Fi signals from your existing router and it will uh, broadcast them more strongly wherever you have it placed so in theory it just widens your range by quite a bit in kind of a 360 degree three-dimensional way so we're just waiting on it here still hmm. 
might make a cut where it <laughs> like decides to take five minutes to. Good things come to those who wait, man. Yeah, well, I'm gonna check out the uh, airport utility on my Mac just to make sure it went ahead and worked. Yeah. Not yet. Oh yeah, there it goes. As soon as Jenna said shows a green light. <laughs> Airport Express joined not this one or Chelsea Network One. So that's how that's done. All you gotta do is go up and select done and it should be finished. Yeah, so you're selected on not this one. Um obviously like your name and your network will be in that place. So all it does is just takes the signal from your current Wi-Fi router and mirrors that signal and makes it stronger. I'm just gonna, out of curiosity, I haven't messed with the app yet. This is actually my first time screwing around with it. You go to Airport Utility. I'm just gonna see what all it says in here because I'm curious to see what I can do with it. And it really doesn't have a whole lot. It's just telling me that that it is mirroring, not this one by displaying in the network section and this stuff really doesn't matter and I don't even know about that I think that's just the password for the device like um, do you remember when we first set this thing up? yeah sorta and there was like a password that you had to enter I think it's just like what the password that you set up I think that might have just been like for this device if you want to mess with it you know I'm just gonna have to delete that or something cuz I don't even remember it but yeah so it should be extending your Wi-Fi now um, and that concludes today's lesson <laughs>